Hey friends, welcome to FX Yogi. In today's video, let's learn why to trade forex, forex versus stocks. There are approximately 2,800 plus stocks listed on the New York Stock Exchange. Another 3,300 plus stocks are listed on the NASDAQ. Which one will you trade? Got the time to stay on top of so many companies? With Forex, there are dozens of currencies traded, but the majority of the market players trade the seven major pairs. Seven major pairs are much easier to keep an eye on than thousands of stocks, isn't it? That's just one of the major advantages of the Forex market over the stock markets. Here are a few more. 24 hour market. The stock market is limited to an exchange opening hour. For example, in the US, most stock exchanges open at 9.30 am EST and close at 4 pm EST. The forex market is a seamless 24 hour market. Most brokers are open from Sunday at 5 pm EST until Friday at 5 pm EST with customer service usually available 24 cross 7. Minimal or no commission. As a lot of online stock brokers now offer zero commission, so this now is less of a factor. Most forex brokers charge no commissions or additional transaction fees to trade currencies online or over the phone. Higher trading volume and liquidity. The forex market sees an average daily turnover of $6.6 trillion. The stock market sees a fraction of this. Short selling without a uptick. Unlike the equity market, there is no restriction on short selling in the currency market. Trading opportunities exist in the currency market regardless of whether a trader is long or short or whichever way the market is moving. Minimal market manipulation. How many times have you heard that fund A was selling X or buying Z? The stock market is very susceptible to large fund buying and selling. With currency trading, the massive size of the forex market makes the likelihood of any one fund or bank controlling a particular currency very small. That's all for today. Let's catch up in the next video with more content. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.